We have reports of damage after a moderate 5.7 magnitude earthquake has struck Turkey. They are saying that the damage is to buildings after knocking bricks and tiles off of them. Some people were injured, but it looks like no deaths connected with this event. Now, there is some speculation as to just how strong this quake was. USGS is trying to say a 5.7, while the European Monitoring Service is saying it's a 6.4. There have been 30 aftershocks, the strongest being a 4.2. Now, I believe it was around a 7.4 some years back had struck Turkey, and this place swarmed for the longest time after that quake struck that area. But if we look here now at the earthquake map, there's a look here at the United States. You can see Nevada, 3.5, a quake northwest of Yellowstone. Some activity there in Alaska. This area through here has been very quiet. And you can see the 5.7 that they have listed here that struck there. Now, they don't have the 20-some quakes behind it. That's what I dislike about some of these sites and how they track quake information, especially with quakes around volcanic areas like Yellowstone where we've seen swarming and sometimes that could signal that there's going to be an eruption. Here in Vanuatu, we've had a 6.2 per USGS 73 minutes ago. So a couple big quakes. This one doing some pretty good damage to the buildings and houses. They were saying that people were jumping off of balconies when this began. One guy said, this is the biggest quake that I have felt. Said he was outside. Everything started shaking very much. You can see more damage right there in that pic. But yes, this is a look at some of the damage done from the quake that just struck Turkey. And an earthquake update here. I'm going to leave links below. Make sure to follow me on Twitter for more. As always, it's been Dabu7.